What's up everybody, Neil here with Gadget Hacks, and today we're going to show you how to use Samsung's hidden video editor on any Galaxy device. To get started, just choose a clip you want to start editing. Now when you tap editor down here below, it does give you, give you some basic tools like trimming, um, adding an effect, and even adding some audio. But if you want to get a little bit more elaborate and creative and maybe add some additional clips, some transitions, maybe some other music or voiceover, then these tools are a little limited. But if you just tap this small option right here, video editor, you'll then be prompted to download and install Samsung's video editor from the Galaxy App Store, which we're going to do right now. Now when the time comes for you to edit your clip, you can launch the application itself, but you can also just do it by tapping video editor within your video. And then you'll be directed to this new layout, which we're going to go over and show you what you can do. Alright, so here's a clip I have. It's not that long, but I can move left and right to adjust where it is. And if I ever want to split it, I can just tap split right there and I'll now have an additional clip and I can split that as well. You'll notice these small black squares right there. If I tap on them in between the clips, I can now add a new transition for my clip, which I can just play and show you real quick. So it'll look like that. Now if I wanna add an effect to the video clip, I'll just tap on it and tap effect. There's a bunch of different ones you can add to make your video maybe a little bit more dynamic. You can also select text and place some text or a text template over your video if you need to add credits or anything else. Then if the volumes need to be adjusted, you can tap on the individual clips and just adjust them by going up and down on this toggle. If you want to add another clip, then just tap this add option right here. This will also give you the option to add an image and even give you some audio options. There are some background music that you can um, add to it, but they're kind of cheesy, then you can scroll through the music, music files on your device or even record narration, which is kind of cool. When it comes time to export your video, make sure you save it first. I'll just call it whatever. And then tap more. Now when you hit more, hit export. This will then place this video in your gallery app in the videos gallery, sorry, videos album. So just make sure to do that because if you don't, the only way you'll be able to see your video is within the video editor application. So let's go ahead and show you something that I put together. So I was able to do this within maybe five minutes, maybe 10 minutes. As you can see, it's pretty cool, it's pretty fun, and it's pretty simple. So definitely try it out. Let us know what you're able to do with your editor over at the guide on gadgethacks.com. Also don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for some more awesome and very useful gadget hack videos. Thanks guys.